Hey guys, you like chili? I've got a good recipe for you. I'm going to show you how I make it. Come on. Got a little olive oil to put in my pot here. I don't know, two tablespoons maybe, something like that. So we're going to start off with uh, smoked sausage. I'm going to get that all cut up, put in there. We're going to let it be browning up. And we'll put a lid on it. That'll help uh, speed up the browning on that just a little bit. Now I want to slice up just a medium sized onion. And I've got a couple green onions here I'm going to chop up. Green onions to give it a pretty good flavor I think. Yeah, let me check on my meat right here the sizzling. Oh that's good. good. Get my sausage browned, browned up there pretty good. And I want to slice up just about a half a bell pepper. You can use red bell pepper, green bell pepper, whatever you want. Or my green onions, I mean. Put our green pepper in there. Now I'm going to chop up about, uh, about two peppers of uh, some sliced jalapenos, pickled jalapenos. They add a lot of good flavor to it, but it's not adding a whole lot of heat. And just about the right amount of heat to them. may not be enough, but we'll see what it does. That adds a little heat to it. Now we're going to do some uh, sweet peppers. Got to put some sweet in it. These sweet peppers to help balance out the jalapenos we got in there. Of minced garlic in there. Yeah, we'll stir garlic in. Turn my heat down just a little bit. Man, that smells good. Now I want to add a teaspoon of kosher salt. 
Now I want to add a 28 ounce can of crushed tomatoes. my heat back up to medium and we got a can of chili beans and chili sauce then I want to add another can of chili beans Then I want to add two tablespoons of chili powder. And I want to add a teaspoon of oregano. And a teaspoon of ground cumin. that all stirred up then I want to add a half a cup of uncooked mini elbow noodles I want to put just a little bit of black pepper in it come back here and add a little more noodles. I don't think we got enough noodles in there. I'm going to add another half a cup of noodles. Elbow macaroni. I'm going to turn that down on uh, about medium low. And we're going to let it simmer for a little while. Let our noodles get uh, cooked. And you want to let this simmer for about two hours after you get all your ingredients in it. Make sure your noodles get done. Let all your flavors uh, mix together good. You know, like I say, soup and chili like this is always better on the second day. I'll leave it in this pot, put it in the refrigerator, and then warm it back up again tomorrow. Let it simmer some more. Hey guys, you want a good chili recipe, you need to try this. It's awful good. Hey, I appreciate y'all watching.